Presenting petitions, the honourable member for Davenport. I was going to say, thank, thank you so much, go. Mr. Speaker. I rise today to present a petition on behalf of one of my Davenport residents. It is petition two, uh, E2699, and it was initiated by uh, Alex Karesma, who I want to thank for her passionate advocacy through this petition. Um, uh, petition E2699 acknowledges some of the historical injustices behind the founding of the RCMP, as well as some of the as well as the anti-Indigenous racism that still exists within many of Canada's institutions, including the RCMP. The R this petition urges an increased focus on reallocating some of the RCMP's funding and resources toward community-based resources and trauma-informed care, among many other things. The petition also urges the elimination of mandatory minimum, sen minimum sentencing measures, which disproportionately impact Indigenous people, Black Canadians, and people living in poverty. It also asks for uh, the implementation of the action items outlined by the Parliamentary Black Caucus. And finally, it urgently asks for the implementation of the recommendations put forward by the National Inquiry into the Missing and Murdered Indigenous Women and Girls. I would like to thank Alex for her wonderful advocacy, and I here, hereby present this petition in this chamber on, on her behalf. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Presenting petitions.